everybody. Welcome back. Welcome back. Got a video for you. It's a little haul. Like I said, I don't know how many hauls I'll have. If I get one, I'll do one. And it's for this little one, Miss Lillian. She's cute. She's so cute. And we're going to have a lot of fun with her in the months to come. It'll be fun. So I got some stuff for her for reborning. Um, I don't know if any of you, I know some of you that watch me reborn yourselves. And I don't know, you get accustomed to things that you like to use, you know. So, and I had an issue with sponges not too long ago and not having enough. Well, I, my sponges I find at my family dollar. These are the ones that I use. And these are the ones that I use, well, let's see. I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Plus I have like three or four more in my drawer. I am not gonna run out anytime soon. I don't wanna be in that position again that I was in a couple months ago where if I needed to make a doll and I couldn't because I didn't have my sponges. So I got eight of those. Eight of those. Let me show you what I do with them. Because I'm starting a baby over there. Okay, what I do is I rip it in half, okay? And this is what I use for my washes, like my red wash, my blue wash, um, the ones that you have to paint all over the baby. This is what I use. These are what I use. I love these. And this has a little bit of texture. So you can see when you rip it, it has a little bit of texture. And these are what I use. Now I, for per doll, like I'm still using the ones I ripped up before. And if I can use them for a while, I will. And, but I usually throw them away after I do a doll. But I will use these for the washes. And then again, when I put my sealant on, my varnish, I will use these again. And I usually use, cause I'll split two of these up and I'll do one for the head, a bigger one for the head. And then I'll do for the arms and the legs. And depending, I may have to use another one and rip it apart. But this is what I use for putting the varnish on to give it that little texture thing. And then um, anything you have to paint all over the doll, not your mottling. Those are different sponges, but these are the ones that I use and I had a hard time finding. Well, my family dollar, I bought the last ones they had. I actually left one and I bought the other three that they had. So I opened up a package and I think I used that package up. So I got one package left and I went there today and they restocked. Guess what? I didn't leave any this time. <laughs> I bought them all. And these are latex free, which is what you need is latex free. And they're a dollar, a dollar 10 or whatever. But these are the ones I find. Now, I would buy some online on Amazon if I knew the sponge was like this. And I don't know if you can tell how it is, you know? It's really smooth. It's a makeup sponge, you know? But it's um, latex-free. And so there's 16 of them in here. So this will get me to do maybe four dolls one package will do like depending on the size of it so I had to get these I had to get those had to now the rest of this in here is for her so I do have some thrifted items that I bought for her and I think I have one pajama that I bought I bought this outfit and I think there's one other one, but that's all I bought for her. And I really don't want to buy her a bunch of stuff, but I couldn't pass this up. Look at this. It looks huge, but it's not. It's three to six. She's, she wears three to six months. This was five bucks. 
So it wasn't like I was breaking the bank or anything, but it's unicorn. I hate unicorns, but she has a unicorn lovey and she has a unicorn passy and my air conditioner just went off, yay, because it's loud. And so she needed some jammies. They had an outfit too, but I didn't want to get her the outfit. It's like, this is good. And you know, this is, this is good for her. So I did buy her this. You know, I had to get something for her. She's my newest one. And she's got quite a few clothes over there. And then I found they had new pacifiers in there. And these are large ones. And she's got kind of a big mouth. So I got one for the boy and one for a girl. <laughs> and she has the other one like this. I think it's the lamb. I think that's what I got in there for her. Well, I got her this one. It's a unicorn. Look at that. So now she has a unicorn passy. She's got the jammies. So she's got the whole ensemble. And then for the boy, which I don't have yet, and he doesn't have that many clothes. Um, her clothes outfit one of those bins. I have a basket that I have from in right now. And I got him this one. And it really should go to Jake, but this is too big. It's too big for his mouth. So, but it's a little fox. But I got that for the new boy whenever I make him. Whenever I make him, he's going to get made. Just a matter of time. So, there's going to be, you know, probably some, maybe this fall. I don't know. If I got to buy the kit. And I have to sell another doll first before I can buy the kit. So, anyway, last thing that I got for her is because I'm having a hard time finding these little tiny barrettes. I'm like, what the heck? <laughs> they shouldn't be that hard to find. I did find the little kit. You know, I did find that at Walmart. But I'm like, you know what? She needs some cute, cute barrettes. So, my family dollar had these. These were a dollar ten, I think. They weren't that much. But these are going to be, they're on elastics, but they're too big. So I'm going to cut it off of there. And there's two of them. So she can have a pigtail. She can have pigtails. And won't these be cute hanging off her head, little head? Look, I got this one. Kind of bright and, you know. And then I got a pink and red. Good for Valentine's Day. Um, not so much Christmas, but Valentine's Day, February, you know. And it, maybe 4th of July, maybe. And then a pastel -y one for, uh, for Easter. So there's two on here on each one of these. And these are the only ones that they had. I looked because I wanted to get all of them. So I am starting to make her a little... Um, I've got a round bin, and I'm going to show you that when I do the next video that I put her little barrettes in. And these ones are kind of bigger than those little teeny ones, but I needed something a little bit bigger to hook these onto. So, like, this one could go with the, the, the glittery the glittery one. You know, this one could go, get hooked to that glitterly, glitterly one. And this one I'll put on the white barrettes right here. And this one, because it has purple, well, maybe we'll use the purple one for this one. We'll use the purple glittery one for this one. And then the white one. For this one. The white one. And then the. Um, fuchsia one. For that one. I need a whole pack of these white ones. Is what I need. But they didn't have that. So. And I'll save these other colors or if I find some diff different ones like this. So that's what we got. We, we are, I'm gonna do a video um, putting these together 
and I've got one left of my little ones that I'm going to show you. So that will be a video, a, a how-to video for this channel. I don't usually do those that often. I have like the barrettes, the bracelets, the bottles, um, the paint, you know, paint with me things. You know, I don't have um, a lot of how-to things, but this would be good for you if you can't find, if you have a toddler and you wanna make their own barrettes and these elastics, I can't put those elastics in her little bit of hair that I have here. Uh, it, they're too big, they are just too big, but I can clip them in. So, and hopefully it won't look weird. So we'll find out after I do one of these. So that will be a video that's coming. So make sure you keep an eye out for that. But that is the, yeah, that is the little haul that I have to show you. And yeah, so I hope everybody is doing good. Oh, this came apart. How did that come apart? I bet that cat was in here. Now I gotta do some stitching on her thing. You see that? I just noticed that. Look, the stitching came off. I can sew it. I'm handy like that. And I'll sew it in there. Aww. So we will fix her little lovey. But in the meantime, she can still hold on to it. Here you go. You hold on to it. Here's your other one, your passy. Hold your passy. There you go. So anyway, guys, thanks for watching, and we shall see you in the next video. Alrighty, bye now.